We all remember seeing the empty shelves back in March, but it turns out cleaning supplies and toilet paper haven't been the only things in high demand during the pandemic. This is interesting. So there's been a surge for LASIK surgery. Leah Shields, she joins us with that story all new right here on Good Morning Jacksonville. But multiple factors are at play here, but they all go back to COVID-19. Ophthalmologist Dr. Amit Choksi says his patients are tired of this happening. Glasses just fogging up, you can't see. And also they say masks are causing dry eye. Before and after. Maybe you can't see a difference, but Samantha Keenis can literally see a major difference post LASIK surgery. She had the procedure done in October. So, living in Florida, you walk outside, your glasses fog up. That was already a problem. And then with the mask, then you're foggy inside all the time, and you can breathe and just see it. And you're like, oh my gosh. It shouldn't be this hard to just see. <laughs> I get very excited for them because it is literally a life-changing event. Dr. Amit Choksi is an ophthalmologist. He says Kinas isn't the only one going under the laser during COVID-19. He says LASIK surgeries have been up since May. With computer time and screen time, uh, there's definitely a higher incidence of dry eyes. And if someone's used to wearing contacts, they may become less contact lens uh, tolerant. But what makes people want to drop thousands of dollars during a pandemic? Choksi says people aren't traveling as much, so they have those extra funds and some extra time. Now, not everyone needs to resort to surgery. Choksi explains that when you're staring at a computer or your phone for a very long period of time, your eyes literally just don't blink as much. So he says, take a few minutes, stare away, blink a little bit. Get some moisture back in your eyes, of course, use eye drops. And also, you can try out some blue light glasses that might help with the glare from technology. In Jacksonville, Leah Shields, First Coast News on your side.